So guys, for the first step, you want to make sure that the EA Launcher is being run as an admin. So you want to find the EA Launcher, you might need to search for it, so type in EALauncher.exe. You want to right click on it, and then click on Open File Location. And then you want to right click on EA Launcher. You want to click on Properties, and then click on Compatibility. And then you want to tick Run This Program as an Administrator, and then click on OK. Now for the second step, you want to head over to Search, and then type in percent local app data percentage sign, and click on Enter. Now once you're on this, you want to scroll down until you find the EA Desktop and Electronic Arts folders. You want to delete both of these. This will just be clearing the cache for the EA Launcher. It's going to come back once you open up EA Launcher, so just delete both of these folders. Now for the next step, you want to right click on the Windows Start icon and then click on System. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Advanced System Settings. Now once you're on this, you want to click on Environment Variables. If you see Game Data DIR and the User Variables anywhere here, you want to click on it and then click on Delete. Now for the next step, you want to head over to search and type in date and time settings. Click on it. Now once you're on this, you want to make sure that set time automatically is turned on. And then you want to click on sync now. Now you want to restart your computer and then the problem should be fixed. 